Eric Trump wrapped up his testimony today in a civil case against the Trump Organization. His job involves signing off on financial statements. Fox News correspondent Caroline Shively reports now from Washington. Eric Trump finished his testimony Friday in the fraud trial against his father's real estate empire in New York. What this state is trying to do to my father is absolutely insane. And they dragged Don and I into it as collateral damage. Eric was asked about the steps he took to verify information before signing lender documents regarding his father's financial statements. His testimony echoed that of his brother, Donald Trump Jr., claiming he relied on accountants to accurately portray his father's wealth on financial statements. Authorities say those documents fraudulently exaggerated value of the former president's assets in order to deceive banks and insurers. I know the truth will come out in the end. They're trying to disqualify my father for 2024. On Friday, the judge issued a limited gag order prohibiting all counsel from making public statements referring to communications between him and his staff. The judge called multiple recent comments from defense attorneys about the principal law clerk inappropriate and said the need to protect his staff from threats and harm outweighs the lawyer's first First Amendment rights. Anything on this exchange regarding the clerk that you can say? <laughs> Meanwhile, in Georgia, Donald Trump's legal team has filed an emergency motion trying to suspend a gag order in his criminal election interference case, writing, quote, no court in American history has imposed a gag order on a criminal defendant who is actively campaigning for public office, let alone the leading candidate for president of the United States. Former President Trump and his daughter Ivanka are both expected to testify in the New York civil fraud trial next week.